Hello, in this video we're going to be looking at how we can change the musical grid from beats and bars into timecode. Um, so what do I mean? Uh, what I mean if we zoom in a little bit is up the top here we've got this kind of ruler, right? And currently you can see it's got one, two, three. That that relates to bar numbers, right? So bar one, bar two, bar three. And if we zoom in even further, we've got these subdivisions. So the beats, right? So 1.2 is uh, you know the second beat, 1.3 is the third beat, and so on. Now this obviously depends on what time signature you're in, um, and and so on, right? Um, now if you want to change this to time code, uh, what you need to do is come up to File, come down to Project Settings, across to General, and then where it says Project Type just here, and we come across to this checkbox, Use Musical Grid, Go ahead and check that one, and then this will change the setting here in the background to timecode. And as you can see here, it's now in time. Okay, um, and and that's it. Um, now, now, why would you want to do this anyway, right? Uh, well, you may have a well good movie, just like I have, of me uh, turning my blender on, and uh, you may want to know exactly what time it is that we come to here and I turn this blender on. Okay. Uh, so this is the click of the button, right? Um, so you may you, you you know you may want to know that. Uh, perhaps you're putting in sound effects or you're um, rescoring something. Who knows what? Okay, so at that point, I think changing this grid line these uh, you know to time code is a good thing uh, if you're working a lot with this kind of thing. Uh, generally speaking, you probably won't need to change this. Uh, but if you know, like I say, if you're working with lots of films, uh, this can be helpful. Um, now, on a side note. You may not need to change this in the background. Uh, you can always come up to the display mode here and change this to beats and time or just time, and you actually get a time code up here as well. Okay, uh, so just just check if you need to even change this first. Um, you know, by just changing the display mode, uh, or maybe you just need to change the time signature, for example. Maybe you could change this to five four instead. Uh, maybe that does something. Um, it really depends on what you're trying to do, okay? Uh, but like I say, if uh, if you do, you know, find that this might be helpful, uh, just do it as we did before. So file, project settings, general, and then you can toggle on beats or time code as you see fit. Okay, uh, if you like this video, uh, give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, uh, hit the subscribe button. Uh, and as always, thanks for watching.